hello there how's going on lads and uh, this video what we are going to learn is how to build a AI chatbot with your custom data so I have here my published uh, botpress cloud and I'm just going to ask some few questions so uh, based on my custom data let me ask this And uh, this video is just going through the small basics of how you can start with how we can start with a small chatbot application and uh, how we can give some kind of custom data into it it's just a basics what we're going through in this video so in the upcoming videos what I will be doing is I will be trying to add more data more uh, information more data model to create a big one we will add some websites all these things kind of stuff and try to make a bigger uh, chatbot kind of stuff all right let's start doing it in this video i'm going to use uh, wordpress as my uh platform chatbot platform so in the google if you go and search for wordpress so you may find this it's a generative a platform for uh, chat gpt chatbots and it's an open source and it's very quick and uh, very straightforward so i consider this so i'm just clicking on this and uh, if you haven't registered so you need to sign up all these things if you can click on this as well you can also sign up from there so i have the predefined video over there let me show you so when you click on the get started it will be redirected to, uh, to a site which is for uh, sign up so you just go to uh, sign up with google and uh, you sign up with one of your mails what you have there and then it may ask for uh, if you are for the first time it will ask for a few things like uh, sign up for the privacy policy and also with uh, who you are it's for the company or individual kind of stuff uh, that will be coming up here yeah so so i just uh, selected uh, myself i'm not for a client or company so i selected for an all time being like that and student uh, yes and it for our uh, ai agent like this few things so once you're done there uh, so it's pretty straightforward submit that you will be going to straight to a new thing over here from the here you can create a chatbot all right so if you click uh, click on that uh, it will redirect to this page uh, for which it's it won't be able to any for some scratch so you need to select from there and just use a template whatever they ask and it will show to the it will redirect to a default page which is having some set of uh, predefined questions already there okay so this is for the first time users uh, so once you are done with that it's pretty simple and easy it will go to the storyboard kind of stuff and it will start doing the process all right so uh, you may can go to this uh, videos and check how it they are done in some other process and kind of stuff um, so let me start from scratch so what i'm going to do here is this is my template over here and this is this is having create chatbot so i'm clicking the plus button over here edit if you go to edit it will go to a new storyboard studio part kind of stuff from here so i'm doing i'm going to select here uh start from scratch so if you're for the first time it won't be showing enable all these things it will be enabled only with this as i said previously uh, so you can only click on the learn wordpress and it will go to the previous uh, studio kind of stuff and once you're done with the sample uh, then from from the second uh, scratch project onwards these two things will be enabled and now i'm going to select this start from scratch and uh, use template i'm going to select here all right this is that what this is pretty cool and from here watch we are going to start here so from this part what i'm going to do here is i'm just going to delete from here confirm so you can delete from there as well so what are you going to do is from here just right click and you find here start node so start node i'm going to here uh, add a card which is uh, i just want a raw text so i'm going to click here raw input from here and come back to this part and click on the raw input and i'm telling that uh, it's a chatbot this is a raw question so hey how may i assist you all right straightforward 
and what I'm going to do is I'm going to connect this node start from here this is start point which which uh, when a user start hey or whatever questions this rope input gonna ask you okay hey this is your thing and I'm going to end this as well and now if I'm going to click here you can also name it as uh, so, uh, instead of standard you can also name it like uh, start conversation this is a node name actually uh, in detail when we go for the further things so uh, we may use this uh, for identification of further chats all right so right now you don't need this just uh, you have a raw input and you have hi how may I assist you and then if I'm going to click here on the start so you find here there is some option like uh, there is a default knowledge base so inside this uh, So inside this, uh, you find this knowledge base. Uh, it's having the manage and access organization knowledge of one central location. What it means is we can add website, table, rich text, document, all these kind of stuff. Before this, let me go and show you how we can reach over here. So what you need to do is you on the click on the start button and you can find here the book icon. So if you click that, you find here include knowledge bases. So what is knowledge bases? Something like if you have a particular set of knowledge of data or if you have custom kind of data we can enter from here and this will be uh, answered or whatever rendered they will train the model accordingly all right so right now I have here knowledge bases and what I'm going to do is I'm going to add another knowledge basis I'm going to write it as uh, sample and inside the sample okay I have here sample and if you want to add a website also you can add a website over here or something like that uh, if you don't want to add a website make sure that if the website is uh, having huge amount of data it may take some time to render and catch all the things so I'm not using here website if you uh, I'm going to use some kind of raw text or whatever so if you also if you have uh, some kind of document uh, like upload PDF so suppose if I have a lot of questions like uh, 500 or a thousand questions what I what I can do is I just go to click here and upload the document over here that's pretty easy and simple and uh, we can move it further also from here search from the web this is something that is going to search from the web and there were back for specific sites and all these things okay uh, if you try this uh, let me ask enter a website domain or search from the filter or search from the things so it's so you can also explore like these things okay so now coming back to here and uh, if you want to delete this you can remove from here as well so in kind of search text uh, so it's very pretty straightforward you can add uh, cup, uh, if you have few set of questions you can uh, just add it over here in the uh, or else if you have some huge amount of data also we can just have a rich text kind of stuff okay so i'm asking that who is if cat so my question uh, if cat is an online youtube channel for technical videos and tutorial all right let it be like this and the next question I'm asking uh, what in who is the full form of AI okay so pretty easy pretty simple I'm going to write Swift cat it's nothing but it's my YouTube channel all right so okay so I'm going to save this this already here and now going go back to this main dot and I'm clicking over here and just uh, click over here and I'm going to add the assemble if I don't want to use the default knowledge base you can remove this by unchecking this tick if you want add you can add this as well that's pretty simple and easy now what I'm going to do is I'm just going to publish over here once that done uh, you can just share here which is uh, going to redirect to a new chatbot kind of uh, web and 
from there you can have a chat all right so let me wait for this publish to complete all right so you have to publish before you share all right so now i'm going to click the share button over here and now I'm going to open a new chatbot all right pretty cool so i'm going to write hey how may i ask you i'm ask as to who is a cat It may take some time, pretty simple, but uh, even though it's an open source kind of stuff, media files, cloud, good. It took them some time to render it up, and okay, so what is the full form of? So it's pretty straightforward and it's some kind of sample data which I given if you have if you have more data it can also go uh, like that so it's not completely all right so that's all on this video and uh, if you uh, in the upcoming videos I'll be adding more topic more data models we will let's try to explore more things in this chatbot AI with our own custom data model so that's all in this video thank you for watching uh, i'll be providing this link in my video description for this chatbot uh, podpress cloud uh, you can explore it all right thank thanks you thank you bye